All right, Crack 36 doing another video. I'm asking for help uh, with strategy. This is a legit ask. This is uh, on accessandallies.org. This is the ABH or Arthur Bomber Harris um, versus Crockett 36 with plus $69. So that is a substantial amount of money that I was able to invest. And um, but uh, if we look here right now, it's round five and we see that the Germans have just made seventy five dollars wow and the Japanese have made seventy six and Americans are making seventy seven but the Chinese are making seven and the uh, British are making thirty six and the UK Pacific is making they aren't making anything uh, the Russians are making twenty nine even with um, uh, Tobruk a rock in their hands you know the pretty deep penetration so uh, what do we have here so small force up there now this is a mess at least in my opinion um, I really need to knock on his door over here and uh, start and tap on he's somewhat prepared he's mostly prepared with the Air Force with bombers Arthur Bomber Harris uh, but I'm willing to put some ships in the harm's way to kill those uh, you know kill some of those bombers whittle it down and eventually make my way through but it's tough obviously losing transports because at this point in time I can can't afford the transports and he um, can build just ground units so so I need a big shift but this battle over here actually is not in his favor it's not even close um, I should have pulled out I should have stuck to Briant's last turn um, he's just He's, um, yeah, he's not even close. He would have need those 10 units, an Archangel, and I should have figured out a while back that he couldn't get them combined uh, because I would be in the middle. So that's my fault. I should have got out of uh, Moscow one turn earlier. So here we are, and let me show you what I did. So we, what did we purchase? Uh, let's see if I can get this going. It'll start shifting around. There we go. So, how do I show purchases, history, there it is. Um, so I'm going to match, uh, so right now he's just playing a holding game, he just needs to hold on to what he's got, right? So, so right now it's utilization of the forces on the board, which will make the difference, because economically we're fairly close. So he's got this, and he's, gonna, he's got Calcutta right now, he's holding on by very little. Uh, and I've got uh, two different reserves units. That can take it back so I'm not too concerned he's pushing pressuring China let's uh, and he's pressuring Sydney right I mean not Sydney Honolulu he's got a stronger Navy I've got some guys over here Sydney is pretty well all set I think it would take a major effort of probably seven transports and three carriers to really make a dent down here it's just a, a brick house uh, so I'll take uh, actually I'll take those planes up to to uh, Honolulu because I'm really not threatened down here. He's separated those navies, so uh, but he's he doesn't have as many uh, troops as he could. So let's see what we can do about that. So here we go to moving our troops to Libya. Let's grab Libya and then reinforcements go to. 91. Now we're going to bring our bombers down to Xinjiang and wipe some of these guys out. And we're going to bring our fighters. And we're going to have our fighters, fighters and bombers in the backfield um, of China and the backfield of Russia to strike targets of opportunity. And at the end of this, we're going to see that um, I lose a little bit. I lose two bombers. It's big, obviously. Don't want to do that. But I uh, lost two bombers. And we bring everything out to... Honolulu, we bring things to Morocco, I expect, um, and we place our units, and we need to destroy over here just to keep everyone honest. Oh, two, why, why do I have two fighters there? Oh, that was a mistake, those two fighters should actually go Pacific way, I believe. Yeah, they should be in the Pacific. Oh, da, da, da. Uh, nope, can't do it right now. Okay, so then uh, those two fighters will go here so they can fly. And then I would have almost the exact uh, air for, um, uh, fighting uh, pips as he would have attacking me. 
so instead of going defensive and and uh, and fortifying, I'm going to have a, a nice strike force. So those will go there as well as the airplanes, and then I'll, the airplanes will scramble. All right, so I've got him in a bit of a stalemate here between, and then he puts in, I put in, so we're dead even. But that also means that these two forces can't go anywhere. Maybe the maybe the airplane's on Japan could go somewhere. So what can we do? We took out his forces here, and guess what? Boom! Now China is able to do their thing, right? So China is able to take and increase their numbers by. And now we're talking about uh, Manchuria as well as four in the west, and we've got a resurgence. So what do we do? We bring in, um, what do we purchase? Four infantry, four armor. Okay, let's see what we can do about this. Obviously, this is a this is a feel good move. Um, I don't really want to do this. I want that plane in the med. I want that boat in the med. So this is up in the air. But I am nervous about a late game sea line. So that's why we built some men. So I'm going to put everything uh, to boats, and I'm going to take this, and I'm going to take a TUV. Uh, total unit value TUV loss on this, but I'm going to increase my um, layers, my, my my reserves. This was the shocker. I had been playing around with this, and I did not see this, and then I saw it, and I could not unsee it. And all of a sudden, I've got planes coming from everywhere that can reach that beautiful uh, land of the Caucasus. Okay, I take India. This is not. Uh, this is a proposed turn, by the way. Not this. These aren't the real dice. I wish they were the real dice. Um, we had a nice little battle in the Caucasus. Uh, I don't know why it's not showing you what's going on in the map. Let's see if we can do it. Okay. Nope. Mm. Uh, anyways, uh, it was an exciting battle, and I came away winning and and then my reserves go in and now I've got the stack that yes he can attack with all of his bombers and all of his aircraft but again great for me because now he's got to buy his bombers and aircraft again yes I'll be losing TUV not great don't really care don't really care how about TUV at this point in time? I've got a massive Red Army that is going to put the hurt on some people. And uh, at the, after this, the literally speaking, um, what I'm calling um, uh, local numerical superiority. Um, I have no local numerical superiority in the Middle East. I have no local superiority in the East. I have local superiority in North Africa. Yeah, is he going to be able to hurt me? Absolutely he is. Um, I've got local superiority in England. I've got local superiority um, in uh, western China uh, and northern China. In fact, there are very few areas besides areas which are originally controlled by Japan or close to it where he has superiority. And this would be the one area. But if you widen this out, and you now those are mobiles, they can move. It it can be pretty, it'll be pretty close. So, anyways, interesting game. Really a lot of fun. I mean, just. But uh, if, you, if you have any suggestions on uh, changing my, oh, so I should keep going with this, because have we placed our orders yet? Placed our turns yet? Better get this done. Uh, do, 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 do. Okay, that's it. Um, so, uh, if you have any suggestions, let me know. Um, but uh, I think those look fairly good. Why is this not editing? Okay. Uh, good moves, and of course, the Caucasus is really going to uh, just a game changer. So, um, yeah, I was ex I was I was literally shaking when I. I saw that and I was so euphoric. I was like, wow. So this looks like an intense battle. Um, where's all my planes? Oh, 
my planes landed there. My planes have to be here <laughs> because we do not want my planes in Libya. All right. Um, it's Greg 36. Uh, you have any advice? Let me know. Uh, you can do that in the comments or you can do it um, in uh, AAA. Yes, it is still recording. My, my computer died, and I kind of knew it was still on. Okay, so that's it. Um, so we have a lot of Air Force, put out a lot of damage, but that is the strength. I mean, that is the strength of Europe right now, is that Air Force. That's all protecting here. Yeah, he's going to be able to take some of the stuff out, but no matter what, we got the Red Army coming. And coming hard too. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I mean it's going to be a chase. Awesome. Okay, um, I'm pretty excited about this game. So and excited about this move. But if you have any suggestions, let me know. Since it's Crockett 36 in a tutorial game. Okay. Uh, out.